Mr. Morris and I have been putting out content for years, be it novels, podcasts, music, gaming videos. And as a result, having our stuff out there in the public eye, well, you receive all kinds of feedback, both positive and negative. And we've found with the paranormal that feedback that you receive on your content, well, for lack of a better word, it's pretty direct. This is a waste of time. Why are you doing this? Why bother? Clearly, you faked that. And honestly, I do think that some of the questions that arrive from this quote-unquote negative feedback are pretty valid. And I thought this would be a great opportunity just to put out there some of the reasons why T and I not just go on investigations, but why we share this content and why we just seem so excited to release a new episode or a new five-minute paranormal or to drop something on social media. It might be easier to start with the why nots, <laughs> the, the reasons that don't apply. So for starters, we are not out there for shock value or to get as many likes as we can possibly get. Now, don't get me wrong, likes equal exposure, and we do want to get our content out there, but it is not something driven by us needing attention. I mean, let's face it, we're, we're two dads. You know, we are no longer, uh, for lack of a better word, spring chickens. So it's not all about look at me, look at me, look at me. It's, it's not about that really at all. Secondly, we in no way, shape, or form are trying to prove the existence of ghosts. That spirits exist, that an afterlife exists, that there is this cosmic other. We're not trying to do that at all. T and I both have our opinions, and I think we're pretty clear about sharing you know, that those are our opinions. And so we're not trying to convince you or your neighbor or your mother or your sister or your brother that ghosts are real. So then... Why? Why bother? Why are we wasting our time? Why do this if we're not trying to be internet famous or trying to prove to the world that Casper is real? T and I, we are storytellers. Long before we began any of this, long before he and I met, we were storytellers. And this is an opportunity for us putting content out there to share a pretty incredible narrative. So you have the story of T and I and our journey as paranormal investigators, how we are learning and growing in this, in this field. And I think that is something that can be inspiring for people to, to see, to see the process, to see the reality of it and to see that it is so dynamic and it is something that if you're interested enough, you yourself can do. And it's just a fun story to tell. And so that's our personal story. But then there's the story of these incredible locations that we get to go to and the story of the lives that pass through these spots. So it's really everything that T and I have always been into just through a very different lens. What else? What else? Here's a good example. It never gets dull catching an EVP. Were you scared? Is this long grass here? When you, uh, when you faced against the Confederate Army? It is always flippin' exciting when you're reviewing your evidence and you hear a voice that was absolutely not there at the time that you were recording. It's always exciting. It never, never, never gets boring. It gives you a sense of wonder, a sense of magic. And that's a, such a valid thing to share. You know, even if we can have one viewer out there say, huh, I can't explain that, and make the world just a little bit bigger, 
that's doing a huge service because it is an incredible thing to have your your perception shifted or expanded even even just a little bit. There's not enough magic in the world these days and we live in an era of great technological advancement where it's rapid. You know, technology, new technology is dropping every day. We've got supercomputers in the palm of our hands. It's just nice to know that we don't have the answers to everything. And I think putting our content out there is is a reminder to folks that you know, we can't can't explain everything. And if we can give one or two or three people just a moment of pause as they enjoy this content, well, that alone would be reason enough to do this. Are you a paranormal investigator? We would love to hear why you're putting your content out there. Please leave us a comment in the comment sections. One of the things we love the most about putting our content out there is the opportunity to interact with people, to answer questions, to have discussions. So uh, please have at it. And that wraps it up. On behalf of us here at Old Spirits, thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe and enable those notifications. And with all that said, stay safe out there and we'll see you in the field.